Well, we know a lot of you are missing all the excitement of pro sports this spring, but in Taiwan, the Chinese Professional Baseball League has decided to forge ahead with its season. A controversial decision made all the more unusual by the placement of fake fans in the stands. They even simulate the sounds of cheers. Real fans are being kept out to protect against COVID-19. A birthday tribute for this second World War veteran in Fort Erie, Ontario. Burdett had originally planned to celebrate turning 105 with a house party, but now with physical distancing in effect, his friends and family had to find another way to mark the big day. Around 50 cars took place in a parade outside Burdett's house, including his son, who you saw earlier riding on the fire engine. Burdett said that the drive-by honks, balloons, and signs made him feel like the Queen of England. And after all, it's not every day you turn 105. Congratulations. A round of applause for Captain Tom Moore in Bedfordshire, England. The 99-year-old Second World War veteran has just crossed the finish line of his fundraising campaign that's caught the attention of people around the world. He promised to complete 100 lengths of his backyard to raise 1,000 British pounds for the UK's National Health Service. But he raised a lot more than that. This morning, donations total over 12 million pounds, the equivalent of 21 million Canadian dollars. Here's what Moore had to say about that incredible turnout. I think it's absolutely <laughs> fantastic sum of money. We would never imagine that sort of money. It, it's just, a, it's just, a, it, it, it's unbelievable that people would be so kind. Moore has also checked off another goal during the campaign. He wanted to complete all 100 laps before his 100th birthday, and that's at the end of the month. Now, with the stunning success of the fundraiser, he certainly has one more reason to celebrate.